zoom out how phenomenal I've actually got two of them do the same so let's say I wanted green and purple which is the colors I ordered I put them both in my cart the only thing I will say is it's just too tall so it's it is in the way of the gear knob which is a little bit annoying but you know sometimes you just gotta give up certain stuff to want to have something nice in life that's how the stuff goes five bucks I mean why in God's name would I spend hundreds of euros at a place that you know charge so much for something you can do for so less and the nice thing is you know with this if you don't want it get it out and throw it in the bin or whatever you feel like so that's also why I got this because I'm a brokey well, I also don't feel like it would look nice on my car having starlight ceilings in a mess there that's like buying a hoopty and putting Rolls Royce stars in the ceiling like that shit will look ugly god damn it like a on the accord or whatever right like there's some people that get like a Honda Accord or a Civic and they put star lights in it and then, and then I think to each their own I suppose it does not make the car look nicer if you know what I mean a car that really suits star lights is a Tesla model plane S and a you know GTI in my opinion the Mark 8 GTI not the older ones the new ones which I must say I'm a very big fan of them pretty nice how they look and um, yeah they're durable hopefully so we're gonna test them out obviously eventually at night time because I haven't tested them at night yet but I'm very excited and um, I'm just glad that these actually came in it took about three weeks so yeah let me show what else I got so I'm gonna be very honest to you right now this is one of these items that I'm not really 100% convinced of really going to put on my car because it actually this is my durability in the mirrors carbon fiber look alike now they obviously say on the website of aliexpress that these are supposed to help against water which is kind of bs it does really nothing it's just for looks i don't know if these will look good i i haven't tested them yet we're gonna be testing it out soon yeah but they might be cool they might just be a complete miss we'll have to find out that's that stuff for cars and stuff like that you know but besides that we had a wonderful birthday i really had a great birthday i loved it so much like i said i don't ask for stuff you know i'm not materialistic anymore as i used to i used to be very crazy for my birthday oh, i want this i want that at an eventual age you grow up and you start to realize it's great having all this materialistic stuff but doesn't mean everything you know but this is a different type of thing I thought this is so dope it's for my own car let me just look at it right I think it's awesome and they stink as well so basically what you do you have to clean your rear mirrors and you basically take the strip down and that's it it's only for looks for me in this case I didn't buy it because of its effectiveness because it does check it just doesn't it doesn't do much they claim it's supposed to help against the rain which we both know it's just for looks but yeah I thought I would grab these for myself because um, I wanted to pin bump one car a little bit I gotta say this is probably without a doubt my favorite item that I've bought I wanted something for my key because I actually dropped my key about a month ago and sort of damaged it but also kind of wanted for looks I think it just looks more sleek, it looks nicer, yes it's got a trunk thing on it but that's the thing about my car or the Master CX-3, you don't have a button like an Audi Q5 or a GTI where you open the trunk, you have to open it with your hand which is not the end of the world, you know it's not an AMG or something that glass price so not the end of the world but I wanted something for my key, the only downside I actually got no clue how to open this up I'll be very honest to you guys I don't know how my dad fixed it but I gotta say I love the fact that the Mazda logo pops out and just everything else I got it in rose gold because rose gold is just one of the nicest colors in my opinion that I, I love rose rose a pink sorry man I'm, I'm thinking that's dirty person it's just silicone nothing else but it protects the keys and it just makes it look really nice in my opinion I 
zero hardlock I'll show you so because I've got a screen in my car it's not a pop-up screen like an Audi A5 it's a permanent screen I wanted something to protect it because you know you never really know I think it also just looks nice so I bought a screen for my Mazda <laughs> I love the car so much honestly there's nothing negative I can say about this car except that it's not a turbo no pop banks which you know if it was I would obviously do that but anyways it sounds good with the uh, carbon fiber on it already I got carbon fiber the only piece of carbon fiber that I have is the exhaust but I've said this before I want to actually replace the carbon fiber exhaust that I have not Miltech it's like a German other brand also top five or something and I want a Krabovic I have found a system for it it's just that they're small I don't want a small exhaust I want the ones I got currently that size but anyways it and 
you're apparently supposed to take the steering wheel off. As yeah, I didn't know that. But. So when I bought this, I thought, oh, you know, you just cover it up like my brother's car used to have. You actually have to put it on. I don't like my steering wheel, being very honest. Um, it's boring, and it, you know, some situations it, it doesn't really give you so much grip. So I thought, man, the Q5, like my mom's car. Oh my god, this thing drives phenomenal, dude. I can only imagine how a Rolls Royce must drive for a Bentley. Like, wow. So, I mean, the steering wheel is like a racing steering wheel, but it's so elegant. Like, with the mess, you have to use both your hands. Like, do this, this. With the, with the Audi, just like a fingertip and you move. It's amazing. The steering wheel is so nice. But anyways, right. Yeah, I wanted a new steering wheel cover because I didn't like it. It was boring. Yeah, it didn't do much for myself. So So this is the last thing that I bought, and I know you may be thinking, I got no clue what that is. It's for the side when you enter the car. Uh, I'm not doing it at the back, because I don't really use the back. No, I don't get any action. I haven't been getting action at all for the past few months, so, you know, then that's nasty. I mean, I don't care why people do it in the back seat. My car isn't big enough to do that in the first place, even if you move all the chairs forward, and it ain't that big. It's a small little car, you know, well small but it's not that small but you get what I mean carbon fiber look like as I move in and out the car so often daily I don't want to scratch my car I just also want it for her looks as well so that's why I got this bad boy anyways thank you guys so much for watching this video and it meant a lot to me the birthday wishes honestly I kind of want to say I'm overwhelmed that's kind of weird you know I mean that's not really it oh my god I'm so overwhelmed I'm gonna cry no I'm not like I used to be years ago when I had my play button which was obviously a big achievement I actually had a guy in school believe it or not who found out about my channel as well he was laughing at me that I cried about the fact that I had a play button and I was like dude that's my biggest achievement and you're probably not gonna achieve anything within your life the way you act and I think I actually I actually really wonder what he does nowadays it doesn't interest me but it was stuff like that back in the days that I never understood was it pure jealousy of people or that they really think I was stupid. Maybe both. I don't know. But it doesn't matter. But these were my birthday gifts that I bought myself. A disclaimer yet again. I haven't received or gotten anything from my parents. And that's because of the fact I don't want anything. I don't feel like I need anything. I've got everything already that I have in life. Family. A roof under my head. I've got a car. And I thought, you know what, let me just go ahead and support myself. And some cool stuff cool accessories for my car now i know a lot of you may look at this and feel like oh man you're gonna make your car look cheap at the end of the day it's my decision you know it's like i said it's as if you buy a hope the end put stars in the ceiling it's not everyone's taste but some people don't care about what others think some people just do what they desire and that's what i want i want to make this car my car i i, I want to change it because i don't want to drive in the car that has been modded by the previous owner i want to make it even cooler so without further ado, thank you all so much for watching this video. I'm disappointed about yesterday's result, but man, I'm just I'm just bamboozled by the fact that we had an amazing season. We definitely had a better season in Arsenal, because at least we got a trophy. Arsenal hadn't. But next season, well, I do not know who's going to be champions of Premier League. I, I hope to God, not City again. I'm getting sick and tired of that oil club ruining football. And yes, I am a jealous little bastard because I'm just upset by the fact that we have not got a great ownership on the club. But yeah, thanks so much for watching, man. Peace out.